Okay, so for this question then, I've sketched the trajectory of the rugby ball and we're told that it has a maximum distance of 40 metres, so when it's kicked from here, and so it's going to pass through the point 40, 0, and it reaches a maximum height of 12 metres. Well, that means that because this is modelled as a quadratic curve, then this point up here must have coordinates on that line of symmetry. So it's going to have a coordinates 20 and then 12. So we've got to get the equation of this trajectory. And one way that you could do this is to say, well, OK, we know that when h equals 0, x will either equal 0 or 40. And so that means that we could either have x as a factor or x minus 40 or even 40 minus x. I'm going to go for 40 minus x knowing that this is a negative quadratic and you can see that you're going to get x times minus x here which is going to be minus x squared. You don't have to do that. You could have this as h equals and you've got when h is 0 you know that x could equal 0 or you've got the other factor which could be equal to 40 as x minus 40. It's up to you. The thing is don't leave it in these two forms. Okay, It's got to pass through 2012 and so we're going to need a constant to enable that to happen. So I'm going to stick a constant in here, call it a. I could use the same constant here, although it won't be the same value as this a. I'm going to change it to another constant, let's say b. But whatever this constant a is, b will be the negative of it. OK, I'll just put it down here that the constant b will equal minus a. OK, let's just work with this one here. Now, we've got to establish what that constant a is. And so it's easily done because all we need to do is just substitute when x equals 20. We know that maximum height h equals 12. And if you do that, let's say we substitute it in here then, we therefore have that 12 equals a times 20. I'll just write it as 20a times... 40 minus the 20, which is going to be 20. So we've got 400a on the right hand side here. So a must be equal to 12 divided by 400. And I would cancel top and bottom here by 4, and that would just give me 3 over 100. So what we end up with for the equation for h, or one possible equation, is h equals 300 x times 40 minus x. Or if you did this version, you would have h equals minus 3 over 100 times x times x minus 40. Check it out, OK, if you unsure how I got that. OK, just by substituting these values in, you'll find that the constant b is minus three hundredths. Okay, so I hope it's given you an idea anyway on one way of doing that question.